If you're uploading your videos using the YouTube app and you are still struggling to get a high quality video uploaded to YouTube, I have some solutions for you in this video, starting with solution number one. Make sure you're viewing the video in the highest possible quality. Now I know what you're thinking, yeah, I'm looking at it in the highest possible quality, but you might not be. YouTube has changed some things around and by default, a lot of people are being served a lower quality video. Let me show you how to double check those settings. Open up the YouTube app and navigate to your video. Once you're on your video, look for the settings icon gear, click on that, and then look at the quality setting. If you see that the quality setting does not match the quality that you uploaded, go ahead and tap on quality. Once that loads up, look for the advanced option, tap on that. This is where you should see several options starting at 144p all the way up to the highest quality that you uploaded. And if the quality you uploaded at is not showing here, let's move on to solution number two. Solution number two is to wait for YouTube to finish encoding your video. When you upload your video, YouTube has to re-encode the video to prepare to stream on their platform. Sometimes a video can get stuck in the encoding process and it can take longer than other videos. Errors do happen. If it's been several days and you still haven't seen a change, then there could be an internal error with YouTube and you're not going to get a higher quality encode. This is another reason why it's a good idea to upload your video and keep it in private to make sure that it actually gets encoded before you publish the video and end up with a worse encode. But once you publish a video and it starts getting views, you really don't want to delete it. So it's better to upload in private and then wait for all the encoding to be finished. Solution number three is to make sure that your upload settings are set correctly inside of the YouTube app. Tap on your profile down in the bottom right hand corner Go up to the top and click on the gear icon, which is the settings. Go down until you see uploads, click on uploads and make sure full quality is selected. If it is not selected, click on that and select full quality. Solution number four is to make sure that your frame rate is set correctly. Most people upload to YouTube at 24 frames per second or 30 frames per second. You can also upload at 60 frames per second if you want like an ultra hyper real look but most people are uploading between 24 and 30 frames per second. If you fall under 24 frames per second, your video is not gonna look very good. Solution number five, and I really hate to even mention this one, but make sure you are rendering your video out in the highest possible quality in whatever app that you're using. If you're trying to render out at 4K, make sure the encode settings is set to 4K. A lot of people make this mistake. I've made the mistake. Sometimes the apps will reset and will encode out at 720 or something low. Accidents and mistakes happen, so get in the habit of double checking this before you render every video. Now, if you've tried all of those solutions and you're still getting a low quality upload, I've got one more for you that's sure to work. Open up the YT Studio app. They've recently added the ability to upload videos through that app. So you have the main YouTube app and you have the YT Studio app. This is also free, it's an app by YouTube. Look at the top, you have the little plus icon. Tap on the plus icon and upload your video this way. Now, one of these solutions is bound to work, but if they don't, don't at me at YouTube over on X, at Team YouTube. They're very responsive over there and let them know that these are all the steps that you tried. And if you wanna learn how to make a great looking thumbnail on your phone using a free app, click on the video that's showing on the screen right now and I'll show you how to do that. Thanks so much for watching and I'll see you in the next video.